cracking welcome back welcome back welcome back what <laughs> what what what's funny yeah welcome back it's classic you know what i'm saying i guess classic to her, to what what show was that you know what i can't we had this conversation had before this conversation and somebody before. still don't fuck actually me somebody named it and they put it in our uh comment things on, on the video we did that and now i can't think of it anymore it's was it taxi back. no it's, what was it yes huh my old man you drink <laughs> too much you sure yeah well, you know what it was it was because yeah that's what they, that's what they said yeah it was but hey Thanks for tuning in again. It's another Sip Sun Friday. I'm who you be? And it's, huh? Who you be? Who I be? Yeah, you didn't introduce yourself. Man, you just said welcome hey, back. They know me by now. Well, if you're new to the channel, this is Mr. Mel Style. Oh, Mr. What? Mr. Mo Style. Mm -hmm. You deaf? I mean, you had chicken and I just feel huh? like it's throwing you off. It's throwing me off. Popeye's chicken will throw you off a little bit, but. Lady Mo Style. And we back for another Sip Sun Friday. And I'll, mm, yeah, chicken, mm, tea, I should have brushed my teeth. Mm -hmm. Why can't I, you know, to get that, that Popeyes. Really? <laughs> but we back with another one. And if y'all seen the last video, I told y'all about a wine. And this is it. So, we're going to check this out for the first time. I'm going to let you do the duties. I don't know nothing about the wine. I don't either. You picked it? I just picked it. I just know it's black on. So it's a black on. It's black on. It's locally from here in Texas. And now I got to do my you, you, you can read the tag. The tag it tells you everything. You know how Look, to I do my glasses on. Oh my god. It is wonder 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 how are the correct set of way to say it. If we saying it wrong, let us know, but I believe it's one dry cocktail wines, which normally cocktail wines are sweet. <laughs> Um, yeah, because I think a boys we had uh, the Maison. His his was a what? No, no his it was, was a, a it was a dry one. Yeah, it was a dry one. Um, um, this one has thirteen point nine um, percent alcohol in it. Um, it says semi sweet, beautifully balanced, great wine infused with natural fruit extracts. Um, it says great for mixing. Hmm. I, maybe you mix it with like a tequila uh, or something like that. I think you just said tequila because that's what I always drink, tequila. I have no idea. I have to figure this one out. Hey, people from One Drop, let us know which I've mixed it with because I want to try that. Yeah, it says uh, um, it's a sip differently. It's a cocktail wine, <laughs> blurred the lines between a premium wine and a craft cocktail. Uh, a beautifully balanced wine experience. Our fruit forward wine collection infused with natural berries, citrus, and exotic fruits uh, extracts for y'all this gold writing. Old eyes, she getting blind. Put your glasses on, Linda. Put your glasses on. <laughs> Smooth and juicy finish. Aged in a small batches. Taste, uh, tasteful. Crafted. And for any occasion. And yeah, so this is a Texas family owned, yes. and which is by Whitney and Chad. She, on that little tag that's on there, I believe that's them. Y'all probably can't see it. No. I we'll, probably would have to zoom in. We'll put a little picture in there. You doing you doing too much? Nah, you're never doing too much for the camera. You're, doing too much. you're never doing too much for the camera. Let me zoom that you in. You can like that. add a picture in there. Yeah, I can, but I want to zoom it in. This is what I want to do. Oh yeah, my god. Now they need to Let me back it up. Y'all see that right there? It focuses. My camera's good. You see that? But that's them right there. You know what? It, it says it's a five time medal winner. So yes. We're we about to see. And it's like made in Texas. I just said that. Um, it's a, and what's the peach and peace? Peach and peace. I definitely need a little that. So, we already had it chilled. So, we're going to see. <clears throat> Man. 
must know when we get to start drinking, I always get dry for some reason. I noticed that last few times. That's that chicken, sir. Oh, yeah, that chicken. <laughs> I thought that Sprite would. Balance you out. But evidently not. We gon' see. Oh, how nice. He poured me first. So, well, last year, Halloween was on a Friday, and we was, we, we was, we was just, uh, uh, who were we last year? Um, I just seen the pictures, uh, Dead Presidents. Yes. Yeah, we were Dead Presidents. So, this year, today's Friday, it's not Halloween. We could, we actually, could have dressed you know what? up. Was, Halloween actually was Sunday. We could have dressed up, but we didn't, but. Because we, we gonna dress up tomorrow. We going down to Houston. I'm checking out the Swerve Fest. We'll be you know, re recording some. La last car show, maybe for the year. I did want to catch the Orlando Classics, but I don't think mm -hmm. I'm gonna make it. You know, I already sipped that. She was like, mmm. I kept smelling it. Yeah, you can you can smell that peach. And that peach. peach. Yeah, you smell that peach. But so yeah, we didn't dress all up, but we gonna throw some Halloween pics up for y'all to see. Maybe do a little something because I'm trying to see if I can get uh make a jungle juice. She's making a punch. She's making a punch. Okay, well maybe not. We'll see what it is. We'll see, but yeah, so we going to Houston tomorrow in the morning. It wasn't gonna leave today, but it's been raining like crazy. I was like, I don't feel like driving. I think that was either coming up this way or it's going down that way. So I was like, uh I wait until in the morning. So we're gonna head out there in the morning and y'all be sure to check out that video from the uh, Swerve Fest that I'm gonna be dropping soon. And if we can, if she cool with it, we might get some footage of the Halloween party we going to. It's a housewarming <clears throat> adult Halloween party. Hmm. It's a housewarming? You're supposed to bring a gift, right? Yeah. Housewarming? I thought I you guess so. Yeah, Ooh. we'll get something we can stand. Uh, we gonna get when we get there. That, that's not gonna be a good housewarming gift. I don't like. We can give gift cards. That's that's not that a she housewarming gift. That's what she wants to get for her own house. See, people need to stop that. You I, don't you don't know her taste, so you can't just. I, I, that's what I don't like. Don't buy me. Actually, just a actually, I kind of do since we was there in not too long ago. She likes plants. Damn. Okay, and then you can go to a nursery in Bay Half where she can pick out her own plant. Yeah, but I can pick out a certain plant that I might mm -hmm. like. That's, that's your energy. See, Don't bring no, your energy no. into somebody else's But stuff. that's what's wrong with people now. People just want to give gift cards and never take the time out to think of a gift that they could actually use. They just want to go the easy route. Oh, give me cash or a gift card. No. That's because people getting tired of returning your raggedy ass gifts. First of all, none of my gifts, <laughs> my, none of my gifts are never, never raggedy. So we're not going to say that. Everybody like, ooh, likes my gifts. So I don't know what you talking about. That's because about. you buy electronics. Everything ain't electronics. I switch it up with everybody. I try to figure out what you would like or something you into and then I get it. But hey, I don't know, but I I've gotten that if, shit. I'm not with the last minute gift card type deal. That, okay, we ain't got to. There's stores we can go to, David. <laughs> Stop playing. We ain't, gonna, we, we ain't gonna have time for that. Y'all, he always... We don't have time for that. Because we... Four hours there. By the time we get there, we're going to hit the event, the show. What time does the car show start, David? Ooh, I got to double check that, actually. But I know it's, I know it's maybe around 1, 12, somewhere in there it starts. So that's probably be around the time when we get down there. We did, normally, like last time we was down there, what? At the one car show, was there, what? Two hours? Three hours? Yeah. Yeah, so that's at least three hours. Then about time, go eat, grab something to eat. And then what time is her uh, thing? I have to look again. Yeah, so um, we'll figure it out. But I'm not with the gift cards. Just let me know that. Unless I'm just really like, hey, here's a gift card, but that's normally not me. We can send a gift to her. <laughs> yeah, that's what I was thinking anyway. I just have to figure out something. Yeah. But, so yeah, y'all be on the lookout for that, that video with the Swerve, fell, swerve Fest. <clears throat> and this is not going to be my normal, you know. This is more look like 
imports and, and a lot of stuff. I think it's going to be a lot of different other stuff down there. Is it like on the street where they're going to be driving? No, or is it going to be like... It's in a car show. It's supposed to be in a, at a, a spot. But I did notice they said they were gonna, it was going to be indoor or outdoor, both. So I'm wondering how that's going to be if the weather is kind of iffy. But when I checked the weather, it said it would just be kind of cloudy, but temperature is like low 70s something it's supposed to be tomorrow so um we'll figure that out when we get there but other than that this is good i like this it smells like a peach jolly rancher how do i do that's what it smells i haven't like. had a peach jolly rancher in a minute oh yeah and it is really sweet no nah, it's, it's sweet it's, it's semi-sweet I've had, st what's the other stuff do we? Is it Stella? Stella. Their stuff is, what's the I other? I don't never like nothing. I, that's just like drinking a spritzer to me. What's like. the other one that used to, everybody used to get? Stella. What's the other one? Normally you can get the big ones for about like $7. Uh, um, boom, uh, uh, boom Farms. You talking about the old jugs? No, no. Jugs? This is wine that we used to drink all the time. You get from the corner store because that's what uh, they would have. Um, barefoot. Yeah, barefoot. Yeah, yeah. Theirs is real sweet, but yeah, this this is semi sweet. I like this. Something mellow. Yeah. I mean, I don't, I don't feel no buzz or nothing like that. Like you just took a sip. How you gonna feel the buzz? It's not tequila. It's sweet. I mean, like it smells like you can't help but to smell it though. You just gonna keep smelling now. Huh? Because you know <laughs> peach is my favorite, so. Uh, so yeah, yeah, I like this. This is. It's cool. Is that the only um, one that they had? Uh, at that time, I think there's another one I looked up. Uh, I don't remember what it was, but I think this was the only one they had at that time. Cause what's the other girl? Is it Black Girl Magic. Yeah, you know that's my that's my drink. So yeah, this and it mixes well with so many things. Like you can mix this with orange juice. You can mix mix it with like I made the um that little um drink that we had one morning. Just me and you chilling. No, let's get, is it? How do you hear? Is it just me? Get more. It's all called of a me no pause. Get your life. Because <laughs> <laughs> you're the only one having this summer. I ain't, I'm not having one. It's just you. Actually, I got my one. guy. I got one of these up. Now he's gonna turn on fans and shit. Like this is clearly an indication that he's having yeah, his own personal this, summer. I got on. Uh, Don't I'm, blame it on no damn sweatpants, this sir. Is, this is not normal sweatpants. These are like the winter ones. I put these on to take uh, Squeak to Peasy to her sister's house, and they're like these are like good for when it's like cold, cold outside. And I can tell since I came in the house, they've been making me warm. And that spicy Popeyes chicken ain't helping. <laughs> It's coming out through your pores. with with that uh uh what is it that sparkling cra uh, Cajun yeah, uh, seasoning Cajun sparkle yeah yeah you know I sprinkle that on everything. Let me let me also while we while we talking about seasoning, slap your mama. Mm. Hey, slap your mama seasoning, Mr. Williams. He has been searching for your product it's been for the past here. few months. Well, actually... He's losing <laughs> his mind. He had to buy I, an extra I, high. Ain't that, one, ain't that the one? No, I had that one already. That's the one just been surviving. I know because it's too damn hot! It's, no, you gotta lightly sprinkle. Because it's too damn hot! Can't, you can't go like that on it. Because if you go like that... Look, yeah, for you, all the people who ain't got your gallbladder out, you know my story. If you don't, I had my gallbladder out, and um, it was a game changer, okay, because a lot of things that I was in love with, she can't do no more. And she still do it anyway, hard-headed. But, but <laughs> that shit, that spicy shit, no, 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 no. And especially if I'm not at home, no, no, no. <laughs> no, no. She wasn't ready. <laughs> so I don't. I, I try not to play with the slap your mama seasoning because it's not a game. But he's in love with it. Like he can't eat majority you know, of the who time. Got, who if got you me, don't who put got it me into that? Chris Norwood. 
Yeah, when I came down here, we was working at uh, Lockheed. And, well, I was working at Lockheed and Martin. They were already there. But yeah, he put me on to that. And I've been on that slap your mama every, every When I say he sit down, he ain't even tasted the food. He like, hey, I need my See, No, no. I, I, I taste it. And then if I taste it, be like, ah, I need something. Then I'll sprinkle something on there. But lately, what's going on in Texas is it's MIA. It just disappears. Store stop carrying it. You know what? They don't know why it's not being ordered, why it's not on the shelves, you where know, it's at. It's a lot of stuff. If y'all not paying attention, y'all think that little, those little small stuff I've been noticing coming up missing from the store. Like the other day, what was missing? Jelly. Grape jelly? No Welch's jelly nowhere on the shelf. Well, it was some generic one. Yeah, that I never heard of. Some Which is not bad. We tried it. We didn't. I tried it. You know, peanut butter and jelly sandwich. It, it wasn't bad, but just pay attention at the grocery store. You start noticing all the normal little simple stuff. Mm -hmm. Talk you, about them turkey legs we got. Let me no. tell y'all, we was hey, we wanted hey, turkey legs. No, 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 no. Hey, turkey leg hut. I don't know where y'all get y'all turkey legs from. <laughs> But I don't know if y'all scalping all the turkey legs or what. But turkey legs we got from the grocery store the day. I should have huge. This. They were huge. When I say like got this big, I, I, I'm pretty sure it was like a, a e move. It wasn't really like no turkey. I was like, this ain't no turkey leg. It was I huge. Was like, he, but they was like they three were, for five. It was something like that. It was like we should have like, hold up. I looked at it. I was like, man, I didn't got turkey legs before, and I I didn't no, pay. No, it had two of the drumsticks and then two of the wings. Yes, that's so what it was. So it was four was. Yeah, for five forty nine. Yeah, it was something like that, like six bucks. I was like, yeah. we both was like, mm. and when I say them, we, even the wings was huge, y'all. It was they was huge. I brought them home, injected them with this some stuff I use. Season them, cut my peppers up, my onions, and did no, my and, thing. And normally they be fire. Which they 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 what the taste was fire. But they but was something just, just, something it was just, it was the emo. It, it wasn't just no wasn't like turkey. it wasn't a turkey leg. I don't know what it was. So I'm like, man, maybe hey, it was a peacock. I, I don't know. But all I know is I was thinking like, man, I guess old boy from uh, uh, turkey leg hut man they didn't got all the turkey legs now they got all these fake ones in the I store. wasn't thinking it because I was like he in Houston he not up here buying turkey legs like I, I think they trying to get a spot up here too I mean, that's what they was doing the thing they was trying to open another spot but we got the what is it turkey mac that's open up here up in, up in uh, the same people that own uh, the steakhouse we went to I can't uh, think of the name right there and who own uh, Vanetti's I think they got some connection or whatever. All I know is, is yeah, that turkey leg. It, it was it was bigger than my. Uh, some, some, was something was up with it. It was huge. It was about the big size. This part was like the size of my head. Really, you just over exaggerated. <laughs> <laughs> it was big. It was it was big though, but it was. It was almost like it was rubber, no matter how long we cooked it. Yeah, I cooked it for my whole I, time that normally make the turkey leg fall off the bone. Fall off the bone? Nah, I this was like... Foiled something. it, did everything I normally do. Hey, so y'all need to watch y'all turkeys y'all get this year for Thanksgiving. Clone meat. And everything. Yeah, and, they, and the stuff they injecting them with. But that didn't make me think, like, man, turkey leg hut, boy, they be move, they move some turkey legs. Where they getting all them turkey legs from? And I love the spot. Matter of fact, I'm going to Houston. And I want to, I want to get one not, this weekend. I'm gonna tell you what. Man. I this week and last week, I found myself after eating meat feeling disgusted. And it's been a long time before I had my gallbladder surgery. I felt like this, where every single time I ate meat, I felt sick to my stomach. But you just ate some Popeyes. How do you feel? I feel sick to my stomach, but the wine is up and balance it out. You ate that Popeye. You know what? I I'm, had three little chicken strips and I'm, like the whole chicken strip. I'm just going to bring you back lettuce from now on. So that don't work. I eat a salad. I don't have a problem. I, I, drink, I drink chicken broth. I don't, yeah, she you know, does. I'm not the one. She, she will be sitting around here like, what you eating? Chicken broth. Hey, <laughs> I've done 21 day fast and, went, right. and I did seven days straight of nothing but broth. It was rough with her on a 21 day fast. The first seven days be anybody come around me can get it. Okay? For the first seven days. But then the second week is you can eat salads and fruits, but no meat. And then the third week. I want to I wanna, is I wanna do, do it, one, but I don't think the way I work, it's like, man, that's not going to work for me. 
I think you can do protein shakes. Sometimes them shits don't be working for me either. I don't understand because protein shakes be having me stuffed. What well, do in the morning? <laughs> yeah, but I, I don't know what's wrong. With I, you. I can't get back. Well, I have. You're normally, not putting the right stuff in them. No, I normally I get protein shakes. So normally when even when my, my uh, protein I have here, which I need to get some more out. My protein here, or I had Smoothie King. You gotta put bananas. I have all of spinach. that. I have all of that. Well, I haven't had spinach lately, but I've been trying a different flavor. So normally I, I be good because I be full, but just for all day, every day. Yeah. Yeah. And See, how I be working, I burn out a lot of energy and calories. See, when I do my fast, I normally do um, the first. Two days, I just do a lot of water, apple cider vinegar in my water, and I do the chicken broth or vegetable broth. I try to do the vegetable broth because no, it's less sodium in it. Then I wish I would have did it when we had, went on lockdown when I was at home. Yeah, because that would have been the best time. I didn't have to go nowhere. I stayed in the house. I didn't have to really burn no energy, nothing yeah. crazy. I went out moving around constant. I should have did it then. I will say it is the clearest my mind has ever been. My thoughts were so clear. My mind didn't feel cloudy. My body felt light when I did it. And I didn't do it like a detox or nothing like that. Like every day I meditated. I would go on walks. I would do the fast. And I really felt really, really good. And I'll be honest, the last two years since we've been on COVID, I haven't done it. But I did it right before we went into the shutdown and I felt great. It was like a great mental and physical reset. But you admit it, you know, like you can't allow people to distract you and be doing other things. Like he'll tell you when I say I'm going to do it, you, you're not going to tempt me with cupcakes and shit like that. Like I'm, when I'm committed, I'm committed. But if, if, if. You, the first unless that first week if you break me unless it's that Reese's peanut butter cup no even I, I didn't I didn't break the last time I did it I did it with my uh, play brother and he kept bullshit and then he made me twice jack up so I was like next time I'm not doing it with nobody I'm just gonna trust on myself God every day in the morning like I need you to help me through this you know my purpose of doing this and you just have to be consistent with yourself I think I'm gonna start back on one at the beginning of next month because I think Don't wait till next month start now. Mm -mm, you have to it you have to do it in a consecutive way where it flows because of how your days Oh uh, next month is just a couple weeks. I mean a couple days. I don't have a problem with that. You know I've done it during the holiday season. You, you got till Monday, midnight. The new month is, 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 is Tuesday. Is, so um, yeah. I can do it. Let's see how far she go this time. You don't have a problem with doing it? Don't first of all, don't play. Don't play with them people like you know I'm not a, I'm not committed. Because I'm gonna be bringing everything. <laughs> he do. He's a sucker for that. He'll try to bring well, I remember y'all was when I, mean, I was sick. I'm gonna come in with some and I was trying to, like, Yo, you don't want no pop Trying not to eat. The doctor was like, Don't mess with you to jack your stomach up. David was coming home with all kinds of bullshit. No, I, I was like, You I, was I, come home, I was coming home with the normal stuff. Trying to throw me off track. Actually, I was like, "Hey, you doing this? Me and You're the kids, a dream me and the kids, we weren't doing that. So hey, we still got to do what we do. <laughs> Your cans of soup and broth in there for you. You was good. See, you supposed to make sure that I stay on track. I am. We made sure you and didn't get none. And when I do something, we do something. We made sure you didn't get none. You That's right. about the betterment of us, mm -hmm. mentally and physically. Us. I hear you. Connecting during our fast. You know what? Then we're going to strike the fast on the second shoot. Not with my job. Unless I'm quitting my job. Mm -mm. You're going to do it. You can do it. I believe in you. I'm all right. Some days I already be good, able to <coughs> be ready to go off on people. So I can just imagine. If I ain't ate nothing. You're going to eat. You know, like the Snickers Eating commercial. Eating is not always about. be like, here, have a Snicker. <laughs> <laughs> Eating is not always about food, sir. No, it's not. You can I get know, your balance. No, I know because I go, I can go all day with not eating, eating one time, one time a, a meal, one time a day. Y'all can do so, that. So too. normally, I know it's not about the food, but when I get to that point, we're like, hey. Oh, it's funny. But when I was when I was first finding out I was diabetic, yeah, and uh, my moods would be like off the Richter. Like I could be nice, and then if I ain't ate like thirty minutes, I would be a whole other person. 
That's how I am. He'd be like, if I get, it is not that serious. If I, no, if I Let's get, get her to get something to eat before I have to go off. If now. Because if I, I'm the same way. If I get to that level. But you just be doing stuff on purpose. You be at home. Like, I ain't nothing all day. Why you ain't eat? I ain't yeah. nothing all day because sometimes if, you, if, you, if I'm, if, if I'm stressed. Excuse me. You hear it all It is hard day. for me to eat. I'm going to get up, fix something to eat. Even when I'm stressed. I'm going to fix That's that you, food. but I'm, I don't respond to stress like that. When I am stressed, it's hard for me to intake food. I don't have an appetite, and it's almost like I lose my appetite, which is part of the reason why I am type type 2 diabetes, because of I'm triggered by stress is a trigger for me. And you so when woo, I'm worse... You need to woo side more. Woo side. I might watch that tonight. I'm gonna need to have bad a different boys, job bad to do than to Wusa, cause, cause this, I'm not in a Wusa position mm -hmm. right now. So there you are. Mm -hmm. What did what did what did I send you today with Joe, my good old boy Joe Osteen? You didn't listen to it, did you? No. You should have. <laughs> you you should have listened to it too. In fact, right after this, I'm gonna make you go listen mm -hmm. to Joe and sip some wine. Mm -hmm. and, no, and that ain't right. Come in, no. Jesus made wine. What are you talking about, David? <laughs> what are you talking about? He didn't make that wine. Hey, we don't know. Mm -hmm. He blessed. We, know. we know these he, people right here. What's their name? He blessed them with the skills we to make the wine. He blessed, they made it. He blessed them with the skills. Jesus didn't make it. Y'all see that? He it's did. a black family. He blessed, he blessed them with the skills. So, Lord, look, please do not hold me accountable for his sinful behavior. That's all I'm saying. He don't do that. I pray he don't. Because just because we together don't mean we together. Because when he go, I want him to go alone. No, we going together. No, nah, bullshit. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, together what do you want to talk about? Ever. No, no, no. no. <laughs> that is not forever. No, forever I, is when you go, when you... Last breath. That's no, forever. That's not forever. You gone. Forever is mm -hmm. even an eternity. We definitely need some clarification. So anybody who believed that we should be joined after we pass, like you I don't need y'all put that in the comments. It, it'll be a lot of people messed up when they get they get to them gates. Be like, nah, we you you gotta mm -hmm. wait for your partner to come <laughs> up here. <laughs> oh God, don't play like that. Like y'all, yeah, we can't let you in there. Y'all made that bond and that unity, and that was under God. So He's saying y'all got to come through. I this. hope God be like, girl, you held him down for a long so, ass time. I'm gonna give you. I'm gonna go ahead and give you a pass because you work. You did your. You and, did your. Until shit. the other one gets here, y'all, you can't cross this gate. <laughs> nah, cause cause I don't want to be held accountable for your sins. I don't know no, all the no, things no. you've sinned on, and I don't want to get to the gates and I can't get it because y'all sitting ass. That ain't gonna be cool. He'll, he'll rectify that at the no, gate. No, you rectify that on your own at the gate. He's gonna be like, well, you gotta take you take one for no, the team. No, because I didn't have nothing to do with your sin. You had something to do with your sin. Why should I be held accountable for your sin? What if God say, hey, you know, you had Look, something to do I'm with I'm gonna talk to my father tonight, okay? <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna talk to my guy tonight. I ain't gonna let nobody intervene for me. I'm gonna talk to him myself. What you wanna talk about? Nothing really. I ain't got nothing this week. I'm just praise God because I thought this was he about to go into it, some deep. This this not new American bullshit because I don't want to hear it. What was that old song? On Fuck America. Who 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 did that song? Huh? What was that song? Fuck for? America. I ain't never what heard that, that song. Yes, you did. Home of the Lamb. Ain't that ain't that? You killer talking Mike? about Killer Mike? Yeah, don't you say that? That's when he talking about Reaganomics, I think. Um, or is that is that A Ball and MJG? Which Killer Mike did just drop a new one. Is that A Ball and MJG? And I think no, I I no that's. I think it is A Ball and no, MJG. No, that's not. I know what you're talking about. That's it's a it's a poetry person speaking at the beginning of it. He doesn't say fuck America, but I think it, it's something but that he's talking about. Now speaking of Killer Mike, he dropped the he dropped the uh video today. And I think he responded to Charleston White in the song at the end. I don't know, want to talk about him. Because you know Charleston White has said something mm -hmm. about him and then down there. Mm -hmm. So I, <laughs> mm -hmm. yeah. I'm not get, we're not giving him no uh, money. Nah, I, I think I played it last night. When I was playing it last night. The, the song? Yeah, he was the I video, heard some of the song. And he was talking about that little man such and such was at the end. I'm pretty sure that was 
directed at mm-hmm. him. Some people just, I, I, this is what I think. There's a lot of stirred up energy. Oh, but you know what? I just heard. Hold up. I don't know if it's true. I hope it ain't true because this is this has become one of my good shows that I like on uh, YouTube. Like <sighs> Matt Poplar and them. Mm-hmm. I don't know if they playing on the post or whatever. It came out today. It was like they split up. The 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 Matt Poplar. Yeah, the whole show. Like Isu and. Uh, Damn, I can't think of the other cat. Why? I don't know. They were saying something. It was, it's going on the Instagram saying something about Matt Hopper got signed a deal for $2.5 million or something. And he didn't include the other on the show. So I don't know. People, people, everybody's going off on the thing. Like, dude, this, this are y'all playing? Because <laughs> y'all, y'all I don't for, know. I don't are y'all know for real? Because every, every, everybody's like, man, I just started like this. It's been the show. Just getting into this, and now y'all splitting up over it and saying something over money. Mm-hmm. I hope it. I hope it ain't true. But I hope it ain't true. I want his posts. Like, he can't. I like them the way that they yeah, all cause it's a dynamic. communicate together, and they with, all with, with do all their a special. But they say two, people is like two point five million. That's low. I was like, yeah, for y'all show, y'all need to keep doing pushing the independent, keep doing y'all thing. Y'all gonna get that big bag, and I know pocket change like that, but. Yeah. I guess really two point five in pocket chain, but when yeah, you, once, you, so once you get and you got to split it up, then you get Uncle Sam. He getting his what thirty percent off off top, or somewhere in there. So that's not two point two two point five anymore. Then it's like uh, what, what, who, you know, you know. I don't know how it all works or who who's all of it considered a part of it, even though it's like what. Five of them all together who's on the show talking. Yeah. So, I don't know how that works. But I hope it ain't so. Because I was like, man, that's that's became... I like the dynamic. And I hope it's not going to be broke up over money. Because, like... That's what a lot of people were saying. That'd be jacked up. And that has became my show. Especially when... Somebody had Hoffa. Say it ain't so, sir. Say it ain't so. And if y'all don't know who Math Hoffa is, he's the... uh, Battle rapper. Yeah, famous battle rapper. And he's dope. Which, you know what, I never did really, I, I've i never been into battle rapping like that, because I'm like, man, that's too crazy for me, because I'll be ready. Yeah, it, they come for some blows. Yeah, I'll be, like, re- they, I'll be ready it's to very... shoot some. <laughs> like, and so, you know, he had a couple incidents where he, I know. he, he just smack, got into it and smacked somebody on Because it gets extremely stage, personal. Yeah. So that, it's, like compa- it's like boxing in a rapping format, yeah. but you're going again uh, at that person. So you're in a like ring and you're rapping at each other. Like it's very competitive. But it's it's a big thing in New York. Yes, yeah, Philly it's, it's do a, it a lot. It's a big too. it's a big East Coast yeah. thing. But, but it, you if you sensitive, that ain't the shit for you. Like no. Nope. Yeah, I, I never really paid attention to it like that. And I did. I don't even but here, the type of people I was. I think since I started watching the show, I started seeing <laughs> seeing certain little battle raps and stuff come up on on YouTube that I would check out. But yeah. yeah, but yeah. So other than that, the news, I mean, you know, besides the same old Kanye thing, they still trying to castrate him. You know. Well, she got you got the same old Putin BS. The same old. Oh, we do have where they came out where uh, the judge in New York. Oh. Just passed her. In why? Yeah, sign where all the companies that let people go do the refusing the COVID vaccine. Well, it's on the table right now. They trying to, I guess they think they're trying to figure it all out. Uh, they supposed to be reinstated and back pay is due. That's gonna be a lot of folks back pay because they refuse to get that vaccination. And you know, um, the brother uh, Rizza Islam. I know it's like. I think he came back on my on my line on YouTube like within the last thirty days that I started seeing him back. So they let him back on YouTube, and you know he he, he going, going hell. He been going at it, and all of them people that the government came to Big Tech Media and told them to censor these certain groups of people. 
because of what they were talking and speaking. But you know, now they're allowing them to speak. You know why? Because they lies is coming out. Yeah, all this stuff coming out. So And they can't cover up them lies no more. You know, you started seeing stuff, well, no, we didn't test this on actual humans that it and it's a lot of stuff coming out. So I know y'all if y'all ain't paying attention. And it, recently they're trying know, to say that all me. these uh people, y'all hear all these young kids that has been that the hospitals are running over right now with kids coming in with COVID and um R S V. It's a respiratory um sometimes I'm wondering, sometimes I'm wondering on that is how much is that is this actually fair? Well I was about well I was about you to know, say since all this happened as kids we all had I remember being sick multiple times and had breathing issues or whatever, you know, we never got rushed to the hospital or nothing. We just did our home remedies. Well, but they've also getting away from home remedies. And that's another This is a this is a generation <laughs> that's going away from home remedies yeah but it's so not so much because that's another thing they just uh was talking about where how they trying to pass it where the fda they trying to get the fda involved to be able to force the people who do they're gonna class supplements any herbal medicine here i got it on my phone uh, any herbal herbal products like what i believe i've been taking since even before COVID, that has helped. But any any herbal supplements and stuff, they're trying to get um, it to where it's they in control of that and they going to pull it. It says the U.S. is trying to put it into local, traditional, and communal, community-based herbalism, which is what I was getting ready to try to study, and traditional healing. Um, this is because Big Pharma greed and and they wanted to stop immediately so basically what they're trying to do is the senate is trying to require all dietary supplements to be regulated and approved by the fda as of right now herbal medicines is classified as supplement and they are trying to ban herbs so in addition we also won't no longer will no longer be able to sell those and share herbal info remedies so for for me this is a big deal as david will tell you i am a freak about her herbs and what natural things that you can use for your body and how it to the, to benefit you instead of being on medications i've had bad things happen to me with the medications and so i do herbal supplements like i don't take anything over the counter i'm even as a diabetic you, i've treated you, you take some stuff over the counter no basic stuff what, what? You know, we're talking about Tylenol? Yeah. That's it. What else? You, you took some other stuff over it. I've taken a depression Wait. med, and I why did I stop taking that shit? Because I felt like I was hooked on that bitch, and I went and found some supplements to help fix the shit that I, I'm, I'm not. And herbalism, like, I'm... But you know what? That kind of goes into play. I hate to say it. I know this was going on before Dr. Savy. Yeah. A lot of herbalist doctors were coming up <sighs> dead, I guess you could say, and different stuff. The same thing with Dr. Sebi, which was weird. Which would they say? He's saying everything that's going to get this conversation banned. <laughs> what did he say? What did I say? You're talking about this. You're talking about like COVID. They can't stuff. talk like, about COVID no more because I'm not saying nothing. I'm not what? telling nobody not to take nothing. I'm just saying what's been coming out in the news and the media. And then if they do, I'm getting on that bandwagon and sue. Because matter of fact, I got a couple of, a couple of strikes and flags. I'm like, so that's the, I think that's the next step that they're 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 getting ready to pull out. Well, freedom of speech. They already doing that. No, I mean for suing them over tech companies being able to do what they do. It's like I was saying before, you know, I know people are gonna be wigging out, but Trump was trying to end something where all these tech tech companies got a, a protection when they started trying to censor him. Oh, censorship. That's, yeah, that's yeah. freedom of speech. And they get a protection because of the government. So he was trying to, well, if y'all gonna continue to do this and you run your platform like this, then we taking this protection away. And I kind of think that needs to be 
dealt with. I kind of feel like platforms. a lot of you got Elon Musk taking over Twitter, and that was one of the first things that he wants to do. Um, well, he was trying. He's trying to give it back to be have an open dialogue. Yeah, he's so they, 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 they gonna it's gonna be censored, but it's not gonna be like how they just government come in and hey we don't like what they're saying right now y'all wouldn't believe the things that i got i've been getting flagged um, about i know it's because i'm attached to you and it because i like your comments now they're looking at me crazy like tag on what i've been getting it i post repost some things that you think you've had on your page and then page. i've gotten my page flagged like what you posted something about um something about the government like two weeks ago and i feel like I, they've been watching me since so like every single time I post something, they like flag, flag. You've been flagged. I'm like, this is ridiculous. Like, it's good wine, y'all. The other day, gone. the other day, um, I feel I I know like nobody was seeing my post. Like you know how you be but you posting, know, posting, 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 and then and but, all of a sudden and, you get thrown out the algorithm. And that's the whole thing. Yeah. I'm and I'm talking about I got like. A hundred people like liking comments and liking stuff, and then then the, like the next day, nobody responds to nothing you post. Which that, that is, the algorithm is crazy because I noticed like I posted a video, and it's like that same video I keep getting likes and comments, and it's a video I posted where George Meyer was talking about women today and oh, everything. Yeah, she talked about it's like. I see like 20 likes, 30 likes, 40 likes, 50 likes. I'm like, like what, what is this, this one? It's the Thor Smart. Like, but it's, how, it's also probably how you posted it. You posted it as a reel. Yeah, yeah. I think you, it, a I think reel it is seen nationally. Yeah, but, but your posts may not be set up. To yeah, be, reels are different compared yeah. to posts. What, they feed different. I'm, try, I'm trying to learn this algorithm and how that shit works. Actually, I want to learn. Yeah, how. because look, I posted. I want to put a. Uh, uh, you posted one it? video that one I want to put a. Me. I want to put a virus or something on that goddamn. Uh, Babe, you, why are you sending on this video? Algorithm, because that's some BS on how this algorithm be going and be and the bots and stuff be checked. That's what well, Elon. He actually he he kicked out the team today. They were saying their department or whatever and he got his whole team in there going through trying to figure out what's what and removing everything how people be getting shadow banned and all of this other stuff i mean it's weird to me and i'm like but i i, I, I like the other day i got posted for saying something about um i got um pinged because i posted something about the health and the benefits of um of a supplement what it does not because i read what studies was the thing? what did it say it said that that i was was it the independent fa was, independent fact checkers yeah said that the information was there. i was speaking on my personal experience with the supplement and y'all don't know the independent independent fact checkers are through the government so that lets yeah you they're gonna try to tell you that my own personal experience with this particular supplement was not Yeah, I think oh, that's the laptop. Okay, so the fan Google kicked on. Just kicked on. I'm like, what the? I know. I think I did hear Google. I heard the beat. Somebody's watching me. Oh, no. That's why I told him yeah. to take all this bullshit out of here. Right. Because it I don't it like comes it. in handy, though. Really? Yeah, it does. Narc say. You can bring your lazy ass in here and turn your own goddamn <laughs> alarm on. Hey, Google, turn off the lights. I just said it right one. Hey, Google, turn off the living room lights. See? She's good. Hey, Google, turn on the living room lights. I don't got time for that for <laughs> And I can do it from a phone. So when I'm not home, I forget to turn it so it won't be dark for you to come in the house. I don't give a fuck about that. I mean, to turn on the goddamn lights. No, what if somebody in here waiting on you? Then we'll deal with that I when need we you get to, to it. It's a bunch of people coming in the house in the dark. <laughs> if they've been coming in since I was a kid, okay? they going to get what they get. <sighs> You might get what you gonna get. I'm preventing. Google ain't protecting me from nothing. She might actually. She, if she alert certain stuff from dangers, you can say Google nine one one. No. Google stop. She didn't. We don't need that tonight, okay? <laughs> no. Don't but yeah, you you can do certain stuff. You know what? I think tech is cool, but tech is. It's too much. No, it's not too much. It's too much. It's, hey, hey. 
We so we are in the terminator phase. Look, you can see we, that we are complete. We, we are complete opposite. We are in the terminator phase. Eventually, clearly, cause I'm Term terminator. He gonna get shot coming to this door. Cause I don't play that shit. Uh, I don't. I don't. I want to let you know right now. We seen what happened with people trying to shoot terminator. He always survived. Look. So, your best bet is to run. Let me tell you, I'm not with. I don't really know the full extent of my own phone. Okay. And I'm okay with it. I'm not mad about it. Like I said, she. this is a person who need a regular old school flip phone. I'm like, you got all I mean, this, I need to be able to no, do certain no. things on the phone. You but got like, all this technology and everything, but you still playing around. Like, Mama, t why are you writing that notes in the pad? Your phone. I like writing, sir. I like the paper. I like pens yeah, and paper. Yeah, yeah. We'll be on the go. I like, like that. You, yes, you, and I'll take my notebook with me. You can write all your notes. Always there, mm -hmm. up in the cloud. Nope. Yo, because pad. then if somebody had my phone, they got all my shit. First of all, you don't go nowhere to get your stuff hacked. That don't mean you can't get hacked. Somebody <laughs> hacked into my fucking account and I don't really has spend it, no goddamn money. Has either. your phone been hacked? No, but I've been getting bullshit ass emails of somebody trying that's to... That's normal. People know your emails. That's that's the spam trying to get you to do so. I get those all the time. I'm like, I ain't, that's not me. I don't even answer it. That's how they get you. But that's that's still hacking. But it's not your phone. That's your email. They're sending tech from PayPal. I'm getting text messages of somebody trying to use money that I don't keep on PayPal. <laughs> they they fucking should have know better. The bitch don't play like that. But then that's somebody who got your PayPal inf info. David, I ain't used my PayPal since 2018. So if you take some shit off PayPal, you more than fucking but you, happy but, but, to but, but you know they've been getting hacked. A lot of them come, Great. they all been getting they hacked. They can get hacked all so, they want to. They can't get shit because so, I don't have nothing to text So they send you those emails? Oh, I got a text message. I'm like, too bad, so sad because I don't got no fucking money. Ain't shit attached to it. I don't even remember how the fuck to get in the account. Like, yeah, I'm not the person for shit like that. Like, because I'm scared of, of anybody trying to take anything. So I keep minimum. That's why I write shit in the book. So if you access my phone, hackers, you're going to be pissed off because all you're going to get is my kids' telephone numbers or my husband's telephone number because and my fucking family and they ain't going to give you shit. Then they going to hack your kids. <laughs> that's their problem. <laughs> if y'all shit ain't secure, that's y'all problem. <laughs> but I write down. I write down. I spent two, three hours writing down my Fall thoughts last right night. There. She was like, hey, where are we going? I listen hey, to Hey, what's, what's about this? I'm like, you got a map on your phone. Pull out the map. Look at the map. Like I said, flip phone. I'm, as a matter of fact, I'm going to take that phone. I'm, I use my GPS. I'm getting you a, I don't like it, though. I'm getting you I'm Yeah. We noticed that the other day when we was in the car. With I don't you. like it because even if you use GPS, you can still be out of sorts. I don't no, know fucking don't. nothing about this neighborhood. The GPS ain't going to say, this is a bad neighborhood. That bitch don't tell me that. It's called listen. Follow directions. Yeah, she'll take you anywhere you want to go. But you got to follow directions. I follow the directions. But no, she's not going to no, tell no, me, no, 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 morning, no. this is a bad neighborhood. That's what I need you to tell all, me. First she doesn't take you Well, anywhere. that's her fucking problem. You, so she need to get her shit together. You have to tell her where you want to go. I tell her where I want to so go. So that's where you want to go. So she takes you to where you want to go. She still should give me a warning. Because I'm like, wait a minute. This don't look like the picture that I uh, is here. <laughs> that ain't got nothing to do with Hold it. Hold on, girl. What you got going on? That ain't got nothing to do that with That got everything to do with it. She like, I ain't got I'm looking at a picture. Look clean and pretty. I pull up. It's some dirty bullshit. What the fuck is going on here, sir? First off, where are you going? I don't know. I'm just saying. It be the <laughs> shit like that. So I'm going to need better directions. No. Like... They need to be like it's a lot of people getting shot over here right now. Ways of me tell you when an accident and a police officer you, you comes strapped up, two gun bed. I'm not strapped. Yeah. Hey, what I tell you, you know. Uh uh. You better get with the program. You a Texas Look, girl. Don't man. play with me in the streets. You a Texas girl. I don't man. care. I'm not carrying. I don't want to have to do that because you know me. Mm -hmm. You catch me on the wrong fucking day and you say some dumb shit and dudes be saying some dumb shit to me. I might shoot you. So. Mm -mm. I'm just gonna delete I've that whole little part out of this right here, just in case. Son. I've been through a lot, no, and people be fucking get, with you, you and be saying stupid, crazy shit to you in public. It doesn't mean you get the right to pull out. You, you don't get you the don't, right. You shouldn't have the right to call you me a dumb bitch. Get, either, you don't you do. get the right to whip out on nobody. Okay. Please, people do it every day. No, and you see what happens to them. 
I don't know. Yeah, you know. I see what happened to the people that's dead. You no, know, you see, we just watched the young men on, on trial got four life sentences for whipping out. Well, it was that really whipping, out. whipping out? Yeah, it was whipping out. But it was, <laughs> it was whipping they did other stuff too. <laughs> they, yeah, they whipped out and they used it. Whatever. But I know yeah. people who whipped out and didn't, didn't get nothing happen to them. Mm hmm. I mean, that's going to be your case. Look, and your cute looks ain't gonna get you out a, of that This suit. is a station identification. Station identification. This is just a warning. Don't fuck with me in them streets, okay? Do not let my little shit. The it, the fact that I'm little should let you know to not engage, okay? Cause I got a fucking complex. I do. I have a little person complex. So when people say, like the other day, I'm in a grocery store. Let me. I'm gonna tell y'all about etiquette. Because this is something that needs to be said. Yeah, if you if you in a grocery store and you see this lady down here and she can't get something on the rug on the on the shelf and you're taller than her, don't stand and watch. Yeah, we want to see how you gonna get this. <laughs> don't be a fuckwad. Help a bitch out. You stand and watch. You make well, I it. climb up on that shit no, that could potentially kill me. It's not going to kill you. Shit hit me in the face. Shelf breaks. Yeah, move. All kinds of stuff. You know, that's just like handicapped people. A lot of them don't. Like, I got it. I'm they they going to get somebody in the store. No, they, they're like, I'm in a wheelchair. They just need, you think they mm -hmm. need help? They're like, nah, I got it. They don't, though. Yeah, they do. They, I've seen them. They use shit. But they got it. And they can get hurt. But they got it. That's how a lot of them be. Well, look, I'm going to tell you. Let me catch you looking at me and laughing in the store while I'm climbing oh, up on the shelf oh, trying to get a Sprite. Somebody off the was laughing at you in the store. Yes, this dude. And I was like, <laughs> then I walked past him. I was like, that was so disrespectful. What you mean? <laughs> He's like, I'm sorry. It was so funny. <laughs> it was funny, but you could have helped. That's what I said. It was funny, but you could have helped. People were so unkind. So unkind. That's why I say fuck America. This is a whole syndrome going on. This ain't just hey, this tall. Hey, hey, hey. That's this, her, this ain't that's just her, this tall that's person. That's not my feeling. You you saying that? They gonna... I'm about to go to uh, like some place where little people, it's normal to see people smile Said You going to mess with them bush people? Well, I can go to where the bush people be at. I can also go to like where Asian Americans you know, are at because you, you, they're small mess portion with them, people. You're going to mess with the bush people. You're going to end up having a lot of babies. That's all I'm going to say. No, I can't be knocked up. <laughs> we know I can't be knocked up. So. <laughs> they're going to be like, you're the cutest bush, bush woman here. <laughs> they might say that because them is not some beautiful people. Well, some of them I've seen in pictures. It's just not. Everybody's beautiful. It's just different. Like, you know what? You're right. Because everybody's beautiful in mm -hmm. somebody's eyes. Mm -hmm. We all beautiful to God. That's all that matters. That's right. You're right. I'm sorry. You're right. Mm -hmm. You're right. <laughs> I was fine. Uh, I don't have a problem with saying that. But yeah, um, don't be that freak that's just standing there staring. No, that like, is so rude of you. He just laughing. Like, I ain't getting a kick out of it. Yeah, he probably was recording me. I if y'all see me on TikTok and somebody record me from this angle, y'all send that shit to me and be like, Nikki, they played you to the left. Y'all let me know. Y'all, I don't want to be out here in these streets and people, people, people be recording me because look, we was at Tom Thumb and I don't know what the hell this lady was doing, but she was listening to something and like she was bending over getting something off the thing and she was dancing. I don't, I don't, I don't know if she was under the influence. I don't know what was happening. But I was like, oh, this is this is some weird shit. And I'm pretty sure these young kids was recording her. I'm pretty sure. But and they was are snickling they, and laughing. Or they could have been making a TikTok. You know everything. No, these people these kids was not with her. Don't believe that. Some, they wasn't. Sometimes it'd be people you don't even think, but they in there recording them. No, because when they got caught by their mama I could clearly tell them people was not in the one and the same because the little girls was laughing like they was behind their mama. They got in trouble and she was just like, "You, that's not nice to do to people." And she was like, "But it's you know, funny." You know, nowadays it's hard to tell. But everybody, all I'm gonna say, yeah, all I'm gonna say is doing these scripted videos. I'm also say, y'all better know who y'all fucking with when y'all recording people in the stores. I seen some girls in Walmart beat somebody ass from that shit. That's all I'm gonna say. Just 
be on alert. Okay, people not fucking play games. So the wild wild west. The wild wild west. Just saying, like it's a lot of things happening the right wild, now wild, in the world. West. People are triggered. It's like a PTSD. Like I'm triggered by. I think everybody going to P PTSD. I right think now. too. These past two years have been traumatic. It has been a lot. And I think that people don't want to talk about, like, as much as the reset was great for some for, people. For me, because I don't seem like it's been a lot. I mean... Because you continue to do your same thing yeah, every and we, day. We ain't had that. We, uh, we had a couple of losses, but we ain't had nothing. I think if... You continue if to move in the world as if nothing was going on. But for people who was locked down. I was locked down? No. Nah. Y'all was locked down? We was locked down. <laughs> so I'm I'm triggered when I'm out in public and people yes. doing weird shit. People hey, coughing, hey, oh, being oh, weird. Oh, 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 I'm going to cut you off. But I wonder, you know, since the whole thing, how essential people, and then they started fire, fire, getting rid of the essential people for not taking the, you know what? Mm -hmm. I wonder are they getting their jobs back. What there? I wonder is that gonna happen here in Texas? Because mm -hmm. you know it's it was not a, gonna happen. There was a lot of doctors and stuff where that started happening too. Yeah, y'all know wheelchair ain't playing that. Stop playing. But, but that didn't have nothing to do with the governor. This has something to do with the. Uh, uh, I forgot what court that is. Senate. No, this wasn't even the Senate. This was like the. Uh, pull it back up. But I just wonder if that had, if that's gonna take if they gonna take notice of that to hear, especially since when everything has been coming out. This false, not accurate on the end, and how they was getting rid of people. Like the uh, doctor who refused in Houston was big on news on TV. Oh. That, that doctor, and she was treating her patients oh, another oh, way, oh, and they oh. was trying to go through. Oh, I know she just gonna win a nice bag since all of this stuff is coming out. But is she gonna win a bag? She should, because everything's coming out lies and true. They can't prove nothing. That it was accurate. I mean, she would have to go back and say. She gonna have to go back and say. I no. all want of the, money for yeah, all of all of the FDA. The uh, who was it? What's the company that makes the uh, Pfizer? Yeah. Um, yeah, it was Pfizer. How they coming out saying that? Yeah, we. It know. says a judge in NYC must rehire and pay back workers who. Violate vaccinate vaccine vaccine the mandates. Sorry. Yeah, for people who that. refuse. So people who refuse and got fired. Hold on, um, I was trying to read to see. It says an NYC order to it just Bloomberg. Yeah, when they they issued an order stating that everybody had to have it, or or you uh couldn't keep your job. A group of sanitation workers fired for refusing. Okay. That's where it started. Yeah. Um, Staten Island, it says a judge in Staten Island said that the city health commissioner has authorized, has the, has the authority to issue a public health mandate. Yeah, but his health mandate was going off something that wasn't true. So, let's see. So, that would go, that would go back. But, no, I don't want to go into more politics. Because it's, it's a rabbit hole. We, we, like, yeah, it's a it's a it's a rabbit hole. But we we gonna see how this play out. And I just I pray for the people who even now then I think it's taking it and whatever and like. Well, but I, that's what when you cut me off. That's what I was gonna say. They were saying that it's a possibility that all of these young kids that are getting sick right now or the backs of this rash of young people who they was pushing to get this COVID shot. Um, they're saying that they think that some of this RSV is coming from, this is one of the side effects from, the delayed side effects from it. Because they did say that they was finding some studies of young men, young boys yeah. under a certain that, age who was having was on, heart uh, problems. The, that's Kim yeah. Iverson. Right. And them, having time. heart heart problems because yeah. of the supposed vaccine it was a delayed reaction to them being vaccinated so they're saying that they think that this these these this rash is more girls so they're thinking that maybe this is a possible side effect the delayed side effects of it 
So, being that they don't know, this just goes to show you, like... They didn't know from the get-go. They didn't know from the get-go. Instead of them just saying, we not 100% for sure, but we, this is what we're trying. They didn't do that. But they, this is the crazy thing. They thing was, is if we go back through all the videos and snippets, we'll even hear... Fauci say, no, this doesn't work. This mask doesn't work. This doesn't. It. Now everything switched. Oh, it does work. It does stop. We'll, we'll go. We'll go through multiple videos, which I'm pretty sure if y'all haven't seen them clips, where they didn't go back with Fauci, the president, and all that since the beginning of this, and how everything changes. But they're able to come out and say, well, everything changes during that time when you know we moved on and we learned more. So, but y'all wasn't acting like that in the beginning. Y'all act like y'all knew for sure that this was doing what it does and it was stopping and it was protecting. And y'all portrayed that out to the American people. But for most, a lot of people, it's like, man, I'm not buying that. But we know how long it takes for y'all to come out, test, and do something with vaccines. It's a normal timeline for y'all to figure out everything. We understand that and know that that wasn't the case. But... In this case, you know, I get the whole it. thing is the whole thing, the whole entire thing is tell me the truth, tell me the truth, and let me fucking decide how long. But I'm you know what? The, but don't tell me a lie. No. To uh, to get me to take some shit. What's the, that ain't really what the fuck you say it is. I'll come back and say, "Oops, we fucked up. It, it wasn't what we said it was." Like that's some bullshit. Like, but what, let me decide if I want to fucking. Die by injection or what's that movie? It was a movie where I can't think of that white lady actor where she pretty much said, you know, it's a lot of white lady actors. I know it's that, but I can't think of her name. Older, blonde, what was she in? I can't think of the movie she was in. I hate to say it, but she reminds me of a girl version of Mickey Rourke. You might know who I'm talking, thinking of. She always hard ass. I can't think of, but she played the movie. I can't think of what this movie is. But she talked about like the American people are sheep. They'll believe anything you tell them to. You well, tell them to. I mean, it's the truth. We we don't we don't question nothing. I won't say we because I question everything. But the good just, majority of they, the people, right? Out of fear. They'll tell you anything. You won't question it. They have to be right. Why do they have to be right? They've been proven time and time again that they full of shit. That's that's like me saying, what's in his hand? What's in his hand? You both, you just saw both my hands. Before I closed my hand, you saw both my hands. You know ain't shit in my hand. But I'm like, I got a red key in this hand that could give you a million dollars. But you just saw my hand. You know I ain't got shit in it. But you... But you gonna believe it because I'm telling you, it's in here. It's in here. I promise you. If you all, if you just tell me to open the hand, you gonna win a million dollars. I think you, David Blaine. <laughs> <laughs> but it was plain as day that I didn't have shit in my hand. But because I said it's in this hand, and I promise you, you gonna win it. You are fucking say open the hand. And you know what? That that's that's how simple. And a lot of people, there's a lot of people who are woke to that. Like, man, I ain't falling for that. I know the game y'all playing. Y'all can pull that on the other people and see how it is. Because I'm going to tell you, I didn't get it. I ain't getting it. This is what I'm about to say. In the same sentence that they have in this whole debate. Uh, peach and peace. It's a good one, y'all. The same sentence they have in this debate. Your boy Biden on TV getting another dose of oh, this. Brandon. Another dose of this shot that ain't done shit. Hold on. Today? It was during this week. Huh. <laughs> really, Sleepy yeah. Joe? Like, you, yeah. you, you, you know, how many well, times hey, have you had? Hey, you know, they get the special treatment. They get the special shots. Mm -hmm. But how many times have he had they, it, though? They, they don't get the same shots. Come on now. They he just got over it. Not even five, four months ago. They don't get the same shots we get. Yeah, it's just like, know. they get bunkers. We don't get bunkers. So... They get you, are, treat. you are not as important as Sleepy. That's the point I'm making. Big B is the presidential. Yeah, yeah, that's the point I'm making. Okay, you just a random dude who work. Yeah. Why did why? I, Come on now, cut it out. I am 
The random black guy. I'm the random dude <laughs> who is part of the revolt. Okay. That's how the revolt. These comes. are not the beliefs. <laughs> <laughs> That's how the revolt comes together. <laughs> we keep saying these are not the beliefs <laughs> of the entire team. Of most our that's, family. That, that, that's how the revolt comes together. You know what? I don't want nobody showing up at this door knocking for me. No, they're they going to come for me and they're going to have you turn on me. They're they going to try to have me turn on you. And you know what? I'm going to say, tell them what you need to tell them. And nothing I can say I'm against say, you can be used what, in the court of law. I'm going to say, tell them what you need to know. When them right people come to your door. Nah. They can't, you, you, they can't no, use no, no, what no, I no, say no. against yes, you. Yes, they can. You know what they'll do? They'll classify you as a terrorist. Everything goes out the window then. I mean, they're they, not just be over there with Britney somewhere. Who? Britney. No, you're going to be here. You ain't over there. That, that's a whole other topic. Yeah, that's some fuck shit they doing wait, 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 that's politics. No, she got she got caught at the wrong goddamn it's, time. At the right goddamn time. That's what they were saying. It's politics. She got caught at, at it's the... It's politics the, and then we are in... Y'all can say, well, we, just because we ain't sending troops over there, we are in war. And she gonna lose her whole motherfucking life over this bullshit. She be alright. She got ten years. She be alright. Dude, she is. They not feeding her. She already in the prison. People do ten years every day, B, and go home. Dude, you ain't been in no Russian prison doing no fucking ten years. People do ten years, twenty years, and go home. What I what I've heard about. Look, I watched the uh, documentary. Man, there you go. Hey, you better stop. You better stop (laughs) being sleep on it about the worst prisons in the world. And the Russian prison was top in the top five of the worst. Who was number one? Uh, it had to be America. It was in America, but it was yeah, my it. point exactly. But my point exactly. It was still in the top five. <laughs> and we in the middle of war against I, them. I, all I know is I didn't heard them other countries' prisons be a lot better than America. Well, you know, I did see one that was. I seen three. What was in? They did a. Oh, actually, no, that was a movie I was watching, but it was a prison out the. In uh, Philippines? No, nah, uh, nah, it was where the MS-13, where a lot of them was. Equ- was it Ecuador? I think, well, yeah, that shit was wild. That shit was wild. But they already said that they don't have to have her attorney force them to feed her. Like, they don't they don't want to feed her. But is it? Is, is it? She said that the no, people in the are, prison are they, have not been feeding her. Are they feeding her, but not feeding her like you want to be fed? No, like she it, said, that like, she's, are, they are, won't are, are you her. getting that slop that you's mm-hmm. like? I'm not eating that shit. It's probably a mixture of both. <laughs> so you got a choice. Sir, she is a casualty of war. You think they gonna treat her like she's great? You ain't supposed to be. You in jail? You broke the law, dude. It's been. It's a known fact. Hey, three six mafia, break the law. Look, break the it law. is a known fact. That there have been people in that country that played mm-hmm. the same game she played that have been caught with way more. I don't know about all that. It is I, a known fact. I don't know about There is a few players that have came out and said. I ain't, heard, I ain't seen nothing on those players, so you have to show me these players. Because I ain't seen nothing on those players. I had to see that. She is a casualty of war. And they treat now, her like I, they're I, for I, two, I, for two I did reasons. hear. Who was that? It was a rap cat. I think it was Yayo. I know Ace that Ricky talked about. Or he was some. It was either Tony Yayo or somebody I was watching recently, and they was talking about. Yeah, they was over there. We was smoking weed and all of this, and but they was performing. So whoever they was with had them. I guess kind of protected or whatever. But you just can't be over there willy nilly. And All I'm job. saying is, one, hey, it's one, she's gay. Two, she not from day country. Three, she happened to hit at the worst time possible, and they are using her as a pawn in this bullshit. She is not coming home. I don't. I don't years. think they're using her anymore. No, I they, think they are. No, They've been trying to get Biden to come over there. No, and that's what they, they told him. You come sit down and talk to us. No, and we I, can ain't, work I, ain't heard, I ain't heard none of that. They not gonna, okay. They wanted a certain person released. And now they 
said the U.S. From last time I heard, the U.S. was okay with it. They was going, and now they're like, ah, we ain't had no big deal with it because all the other shit that the U.S. is doing. So it's war. I like it. I said, she's a casualty of war, yeah. and she is not getting out but, in ten. But it's years. all it's all politics, you know. They said she got ten years. She is not getting out in ten years. She got ten years. She is not going to get out in ten. Why years. she not gonna get she out? She is years. not. She won't make it. She won't make it. Nope. Mm. If you don't believe she'll make it, then she ain't gonna make it. I believe she. Her, her, me believing she's not gonna make Man. it has nothing to do with there, her. There, I'm just saying from her conversations and her letters that she's been writing to her wife that they've been reading there, and talking about she's not. Gonna there's make it. a lot of people who've been locked up and say they're not gonna make it in their ten years. Yeah, you you go through some hella shit depending on where you at. I ain't never, I think what well, she gonna be like when she coming I back. I ain't never been, don't wanna go, but she gonna be like the motherfuckers who we cast out on the street right now. Who go and just expect them to just to regain their lives and everything be Well, I mean we don't care about homeless people so, in our own com- in our own community, so Yeah, so that, that Yeah, it's just a fucked up situation. They say if you'll step over, if you step over the needy right in your own I just, I just, I just wonder. I hate to, I don't want to throw the race car, so I ain't even going to pull that out there. If if she wasn't, she'd be home. I, I don't know. If she, I put that on everything, you know that as well as I do. If she wasn't our color, her ass would fucking been home. I, I don't want to say that. That's bullshit. No, nah, because I think. That's bullshit. No, only reason, I, you know. only reason I say that because everything is going on now. I don't think that I don't think Russia really gives two shits about that. No, they do. And I don't think no matter what they would have said, America would have been like they would have been like America, y'all kiss our ass. Y'all doing all this other again. If that if she'd been the right color it in would, this situation, who, who, America would have fought harder. To but they wouldn't have got her. That's what I'm saying. They would have made more effort than what they're making right and now. And actually, we don't know the efforts they're making. They ain't making right no fucking effort. That, see, that's assumption. You just, First of all, they've been interviewing her wife consistently. We don't know what. What she got to lie for? We don't know what's going on behind closed doors. I ain't got. She, to, she got no, her attorney. It doesn't matter. I don't have to communicate nothing with your attorney. Well, yes, you do. No, I do not. This is this is serious politics. Your regular jump uh, bullshit ass attorney. I ain't got to talk to him. If I'm the president. I ain't got to talk to your attorney and let you know what's going on when I'm talking with the other president behind closed doors. Let me say, I want y'all to look at my eyes. No, I want you to look at my eyes. I'm not going to look at you. I'm not going to look at you. No, you look at my eyes. Look at my eyes. I don't, Biden, I don't have, his name is Brandon, okay? We didn't, that we didn't. motherfucker <laughs> ain't thinking shit about her. One, he got bigger fishes to fry. That's and that's, that's what he feeling. She's she's minute on the situations that he's dealing with. That's exactly his thinking. It probably is. That's just not his thinking. That's all they thinking. Anybody that's connected with him right now, but she it, ain't big it, enough for him to be it's concerned just about. That's not his thinking. There are other people at play in this whole system that everybody don't see. Just like we say. I said all of these. Just I like just, just like we say, the president is a front man. He really doesn't have any power. He really can't do certain stuff. So we all know that he's just the, this what I'm going he's to just the dance out in front of everybody and say stuff. Oh, well, he just takes he takes the shots, but he ain't the one. And who then is. try to say we can do this, but in the end, he's not the one to give gives that approval but to make stuff happen. I'm gonna say this, Sleepy Joe. If something happened to her, that's that's on y'all. You know, and y'all should be y'all should be fucking ashamed. Sleepy Joe don't care about that. They should be fucking ashamed of themselves. Ask him on the night with on the uh the crime bill. You don't give a damn. That's how it was then, that's how it is now. I just say I just say us as Americans we should be ashamed. We should be ashamed at the things we will do someplace else. But the things we won't do right here in our own city and states. Well, that's not Americans. That is um, that is Americans. I'll say, no, no, no. It's the people we put in position. It ain't just the people we put in position. You walk past people every single day. And your, your, your nonchalant approach to helping your own people in the same space as you. It's the non 
dis the disregard that we pay people that are right in front of us. But sometimes that need sometimes to, that is people is dealing with their own and they can't help nobody. Th like these homeless you around, people, you these around, homeless people that we see, not, they not, in front of rich I'm not, ass I'm areas not, I'm where not, rich I'm people coming out. I'm not talking about homeless people. I'm just talking about people in general. Everybody is just like, I don't know what to do. I can't help you. And yes, that is that is some things when you in these areas when people who got money will step right over yeah, them. Step that's that's all another thing. But that's the thing. But look, I will tell you, my broke ass has been at the light. That's something. And see people with signs, and I don't have shit to give. But what I do have in my pocket, but I give. But but you don't know if that person. I don't. Me. But that's not up for me to know. Huh? You, I tell you all the time. If God lead me to say yes. Nicole, you should. Then maybe I do. If God say He gonna cover me, but that's you. But what if God saying to all them other people don't? I don't believe that. I mean, that's your belief. You you telling me? Wait, this is a whole other conversation. I'm not about to go there. I'm not about to. Y'all see what you're trying to do? Uh -uh. No, fuck that. I know y'all. He's trying to play with me because he know how I feel. I'm just saying. He know how I gets about. But. We about to end this here. Yeah, yeah buddy, because yeah. you trying to get you trying to get me popped out. Hey, because we gonna peach in peace right now. Yes, we are. As y'all can see, this peach and peace bottle is gone. So, you know, this one dry peach and peace cocktail wine to y'all list. Yeah. Cause it's good. Thirteen point nine, semi sweet. A uh, what? It's a good one. Oh, oh Jesus. Is it too, is it too sweet? My uh, daughter gave me my little canteen. That's how you treat it? My little canteen. I get it. Smells. They ain't going nowhere. It's durable. Probably take it. Probably save me one day. Got it in my jacket pocket and somebody tried to David, we just. I'm just saying. Stop saying dumb shit. Now you've seen the movies, the canteen and save Stop watching life. these movies. Because <laughs> you is not one of them people. You is not. I might be, I might be diving to save you. Uh, no. No, you was not double no seven, okay? That canteen will not save you from a bullet. And I'm like, the canteen there, they got me, save me. This is what happens when you watch Johnny Too Much Bullshit TV. You is not double O seven, yeah, sir. I, I'm, I'm, and you ain't what's your other boy I'm, that you was looking at? I'm double O smalls. Today, about to come out I'm with double, another movie? I'm, I'm double O smalls. Uh, your favorite movie. Dun, 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 dun. With the hat. Indiana Jones, sir. Oh, uh, oh yeah, that's classic right there. You is not Indiana Indy! Jones. Indy, Doctor Jones. You is not Indiana uh, Jones. Actually, that's where I always want to be. <laughs> I'm telling you, <laughs> Doctor Jones. Indy was the coolest shit, boy. I just hate snakes. I hate snakes and spiders. Hey, we all in this here. It's if y'all live with him, y'all would know that this time of the year is rough on us. This is a good year. It's sweet. You know, we go to... Because then we, we start watching back-to-back -back bullshit. You no, know, we start watching Christmas theme. No, we watch... This is y'all's rotation. We start now with the fucking Goonies. No. Then the Goonies leads you to Indiana Jones. Then we're going to go Goonies, Indiana Jones. That, Goonies, that is Indiana not the Jones. season. That's we, just whenever that shows up No, too. this is around the time of the year that y'all get started. Then Nyla will get no, started it's not. with it. Yes, it is. Because we always start watching Dave, Christmas you stuff. just started today. We just started what? Trying to find the goonies. That's because of something you said. So, like I said, around this time of the year, we do goonies. No. Indiana Jones. It's not. Don't believe her. Normally then then time, after we do goonies and Indiana Jones like three, four times, it, then we'll do. It's always. Then Nyla will start. It's always Thanksgiving. Home Alone. Her, yeah. She, she home Alone 1. Home that. Alone 2. Home Alone 3. <laughs> Then we go to to Christmas. The, what's the what's the but, her but you know what? You know Polar what? Express. You know what? You know what? No, on a serious note, that is what the world need right now. Polar Express. No, just the whole, <laughs> that, that that whole Christmas spirit. You may not believe in the whole, which I get it. You don't believe in the whole Santa and all that other stuff. It's the feeling. It's the, that it gives the you. energy, the feeling, the caring vibe. I think the world needs that right. So we just needed a year of Christmas? Something, because I was, I was, I, honestly, I was thinking that the other day, like, you know, the world needs that right now, because it just puts you in a, 
That's why. That's why. In a different vibe, a different, different mood. Uh, Charlie, uh, Charlie Brown album. Christmas time. <laughs> she be listening like what the? <laughs> what is that? Why are you listening to that? You in the car? You hear this Christmas? What? She's listening to the Charlie Brown it, album, it, like the whole you can't, thing. Because it, it brings back memories of childhood. That's what she said. It makes things. me think about beautiful it, memories. Yes. The only, thing, the only thing that's missing here in Texas is snow. That's the only thing that's missing. Yeah, I think we might get it this year, though. Maybe not this year, but I'm definitely January, February. We're going to see snow. For sure. 2023. Oh, yeah. Because it's already, it was already getting chilly way before, uh, Christmas, uh, Halloween. Normally it started getting chilly the week of Halloween. It was two, three weeks ago. It was one day. It was forty nine degrees. Yeah. So. But hey, it's been a good one with y'all this time. Uh, <laughs> don't think I say. You said this time like this the time. last time. It yeah, was bad you know, or something. <laughs> stay tuned, and you know, since the holiday season is, somebody was supposed to be finding some holiday theme uh, beverages. I have found some. That's what I, I was going to say. Somebody be lacking and, you know, I got to fill in the gap of that and just keep it in motion. So, yeah, I said it. What? What? That, that's what yeah, that's what we doing. <laughs> but yeah. There's so but, much but I yeah. can say. <laughs> But you know, I'm gonna let you be the king in your castle. Yeah, today. yeah. But you know, so maybe we can get a couple uh, holiday themed drinks before the end of the year. Say it again with that. You know what? Say yeah. it again with that funky ass look on your face. Yeah, I'm gonna see if I can try to start getting some surprise guests to come in. Surprise guests. Yeah, I'm working on something. It just made me think I was listening to. Uh, Murph Dirt, he was on, what was it, Beehive TV and radio, mm -hmm. just another YouTube thing I'm watching, he was talking about, but he's wrapping back up, promo thing, he's supposed to be coming here to uh, Dallas, I'm like, man, what if I can get Murph Dirt to pop in on the Sips on Friday? I don't know that he would come to our house. I know, I know. I don't know, but. Maybe we would have to do it in the downstairs no, apartment. No, 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 because he seemed pretty, he's that regular person. I mean, he might be. And he even talked he, he talk like that. Like, hey, I'm that regular person. Yeah, people can I say like, a lot I of like, shit. I like to go to the same store, go to Walmart, buy my drawers and everything. Nobody. Because we, we can use the whole area down there. No, I'm using my apartment. This is the apartment. This is what we going to do. We special guests. You think he going to stand up and talk to you? Because I, no. I would be like, nah, son. No, we, we, I'm actually... Yeah, he can stand. It's part of the thing. Mm -hmm. He ain't no bougie around here. First of all, I he, am bougie. He not bougetto. He, I'm sure. You get that? Yeah. You don't even know. I know the song. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> but hey. He's to play me like yeah. that. But actually, that wasn't his song. That was. I know it wasn't his. But uh, it's been good. It's been fun. So why don't y'all go ahead and hit that thumbs up, hit that notification bell. Ding, ding, ding. Come on, do it with me one time. Nope. I'm not think thinking with you. Haters, man. I've already think thinking with you. We got to follow up. <laughs> that is not the same thing. <laughs> <laughs> Peace. I'm out. Yeah. <laughs> some time. And I want to spend some time with you. Just the two of us. We can make.